Okay, this next lick is one that illustrates a style that I find myself using a lot when I really want to push the time, kind of nail the time, and you know, create a lot of rhythmic excitement. And uh, you know, you want to sometimes you want to keep a repetitive kind of idea going that covers different chords. So you only need to change the notes that are different from one chord to another. So here we're talking about F sharp minor to D, and with an arpeggio, the only note we need to change is that C sharp to uh, D. So there's, uh, there's a lot of common tones. By itself, it sounds just kind of like a weird collection of notes, but up it's before. The reason we're doing the, the uh, pattern this way is so that the, the high notes punch the most through most amplifiers, the most mixes. Now we'll go to D and start with F sharp again. All right, it's weird slow, I know. Some licks like this you just don't think of while you're playing it slow. The, the ideas can only come when you're playing fast, because then you see where it, it kicks the time. So, well, it's, it's a little weird slow, but once you bring it up to speed, I think you'll find it works real good. One, two, three, four. <laughs> 